Hi, welcome to DaVisuals. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use Photoshop's generative fill for your videos. Let's get started. First import your clip into project, then create a sequence from that clip. Find a good frame to work with. Then click this export frame icon. Choose location and export format from here. Now we are ready to switch to Photoshop to use generative fill for extending our clip. After you open the frame in Photoshop, first duplicate the layer. Then choose Crop Tool to extend the canvas. Click out of the selection. Select both layers to adjust the position. Select the top layer then choose Marquee Tool. Make a rough selection around the frame. Invert the selection by clicking this icon. Now we are ready to generate the empty portions of the canvas. Click Generative Fill from this box. We don't need to type anything here. Just click Generate. AI will analyze the frame, and give us three options to choose from. I think the second option is the best. Now that I'm going to add some other elements, to make it more interesting. Okay, I think this is enough. Now we need to export it to Premiere Pro. Disable the original frame. Because we only need the generated parts. Export it as a PNG file. Bring the frame into Premiere Pro, drag it into Timeline. Extend it so that it covers the whole video. Then bring the original video on top. Select the top clip then choose Rectangular Masking Tool. Create a mask around your subject. Increase Feather so that it blends better. If there is still some blending problems, apply Lumetri Color to Generated Clip, then adjust the color. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.